What's up guys, Merry Gamer here, and welcome to my 50th episode on the JSANO fan server. And as I said last episode, I had something planned, and um, unfortunately that fell through a tiny bit. Uh, not all of it, just part of it. Uh, if someone's heard of, I think it's Ether's Shaders mod, uh, I've wanted to install that, and I can install it, but it doesn't work 100% correctly. Uh, I end up getting a weird issue where like in the bottom left corner I kind of have like multiple little screens and the rest is black but yet my sidebar is still there. I don't know, I've read into it and it seems like I'm not the only person that's having the issue. I think it has something to do with Mac users. Um, I read a lot of things about people saying, oh, it's graphics cards and processors and your computer's not beefy enough to run it, which isn't true because my computer specs is actually higher than the recommended. So I know it's not that sort of stuff because... Um, when I got this computer, I actually like paid extra to get all the beefy stuff. Um, so unfortunately, I can't use the shader today. Um, it did like when I saw like uh, I saw Captain Sparkle's video of the shader, and I really liked it, and that's why I kind of wanted to do it as some sort of little special. But oh well, well, we'll do it in the future when it's running. I'll just do it one random episode, and we'll go back and do what we're gonna do today, but in some shader form. But anyway, the plan for today is just a very, very simple episode. Um, I'm very busy with the Nether Hub, and you're going to see the Nether Hub. Uh, we'll finish off with um, what we've been working with and what you get to see. Uh, I just want to read what Hollywood said, and that would be 4 p.m. for me, East, and I'm out of school for the next week, so we can extend the day. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Yeah, um, we're just planning a little, a little event. Uh, he's been building some sort of um, like capture the flag uh, map. Uh, somewhere on the server. I actually haven't seen I've been really busy with the nether hub and um, yeah we're gonna do like a little I think like four on four little map um, but we're trying to sort out dates. But anyway uh, the plan for this episode is just to kind of go back and revisit all our builds. So we'll start off with this one. This this one is our first ever build that we did on the J Center fan server and if some of you may recall it wasn't my most favorite build. Um, not because I hate the style. Uh, the only thing I hated about the style was the second floor. I wasn't really happy with how this ended up. Uh, but just because of the way it looked. I probably should have just never built a second floor and built the bedroom and everything downstairs. Maybe just message me on Skype with times and dates that work for you. Okay. Will do. Um, yeah, so, like, this was our old storage system. <laughs> it's quite funny to come back here and look and... I came back and did this one time, I uh, tried to get a portal system set up because I was trying to think could I get my portals to link up at, at our uh, own personal nether hub that we built and it did work, it did work um, but there was just a few few portals, I think there was two portals that interfered, one of them was uh, the witch farm portal which was annoying so I moved that at one stage and it stopped connecting, then I could go through but then no there was only the witch farm that was interfering but then I think someone moved the witch farm again and um, it started interfering with this so I kind of just gave up and I couldn't couldn't care less really but um yeah like this this was a fun build it had a tiny tiny bit of redstone you know for our horses uh, it was still most of it, it's all pretty intact like let's have a look here oh crappers I just broke some redstone um, Ah, okay, so what else did I break there? Alright, so let's just put this guy back there. Yes, yeah, so this was like some random chest. I don't know why, what I had in that chest. Uh, I think that was just when I was building this. But yeah, like very, very random redstone compared to what I am what I would do today. Oh uh, yeah, that's right, stone buttons, which always made me get stuck. But I've actually got good connection today. Alright, let's move on to another thing that we built in this... This was uh, probably one of my most favourite builds on the server. Uh, this was, uh, if any of you saw it, was part of the prank wars against Muckluck. It was to send a message that we are the top dog, we are the mayor of this town. And um, we still haven't really finished this. Um, like, it kind of ended with this, like I sent him that big of a message, he got scared, <laughs> sort of thing. Um, and we never heard back from him, we haven't seen him in months. I think I've seen him on the server once after this. 
<laughs> nah, but Joe's going to be making his return very soon on the JCenter fan server, so uh, when his Feed the Beast series finishes, uh, we'll be seeing a lot more of him, hopefully. And hopefully we can finish maybe this little kind of like story sort of thing that's going on. I've noticed that uh, Matt still hasn't cleaned up the vines over there from our prank, so that's quite funny. Then obviously we've got our big tree. Um, I haven't gone through all the chests. Like I've, I've, I went through all the chests seeing if people, like when I see an empty chest, I can go on for badge there. <laughs> and when we see like an empty chest, I've been uh, picking them up. See, I could chop that one up and pick it up. And what I'm gonna do, I think, is pick up all the chests and move them to the front again. So just so you don't have it so randomly scattered. It just looks a bit more nighter. Not nighter. <laughs> nicer. Um, this this is weird. And I haven't built this, but I don't know who's building it either. But they're just digging a hole. There's a sign here. YOLO. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's have a look at what else we've built in spawn. The only last thing that we've built in spawn was this, which was actually a very recent, recent build. And this kind of is like my, turned into my usual sort of building style now. Like the, the whole court stuff. Like you guys know by now that uh, I'm obsessed with courts. Uh, I, I don't know what it is about the block. It's expensive, and it's a pain in the ass because it's expensive, but it's actually my favourite block. That and, I, I really like, um, that and Dark Oak, them two really work together. And that was kind of my real first experience of just, like, trying to experiment with the glass, and I actually really like the idea of that dome. It, uh, it works actually really well. It's kind of a shame, though, that we're not really doing this with the shaders. Uh, I don't even know if I would be able to do it on this server with the shaders, because recently... I've been getting lower than 30 FPS. I've been just sitting around 20, 25, so I don't know why. Um, normally, I'm sitting around 40 uh, when I'm at spawn, so it's a bit odd that uh, I've dropped a bit, but oh well. I think it's just because since we've... I think it's because since like we've uh, expanded sort of way, so like we've got... Um, you know, like we've covered practically like 10,000 block radius of the map. So that might be probably a bit why it's a bit laggy for me. And I'm on the other side of the world compared to where this has been hosted. So I can expect that. I'm not going to get 100% like like two or one ping, you know, like perfect, perfect connection. Oh, someone's been here. If my doors are open, that's interesting. Uh, suggestion, provide books for your clients. Suggestion, provide books for your clients. That's new. Someone's written on that. And we don't have a donation, but that's making me think that we've got ourselves a contract. Hmm, this is interesting. If we do, I can't. I can't show them on camera. No, damn it. We don't have. We don't have a contract still. We have still got um a few contracts I need to finish. A few of them. Uh, a few of them were hard. I think I've got three contracts left that uh, are a bit hard. One of them's not easy. Uh, I can't really talk about it because I don't want to spoil it because I have been planning it and I'm getting close to doing it. Um, it was just really... It was a really tricky one. It had a lot of, uh, like, stipulations sort of thing. Like, it wasn't just you normal, you know, go kill this person. It had a lot of, you know, you have to do this and this sort of stuff. But I'm not going to get into that. Has that been pushed? Nope. Alright. Then obviously we've got our old nether tunnel here. This is all going to get ripped up uh, when the old, when the uh, new hub is finished. Um, I was never really happy with this one because I use stone and um, sandstone. I'm not a massive fan of those blocks. I just used it because I just needed to make my tunnel look a tiny bit more fancy, so I just did it. <laughs> and I don't really use sandstone. I never really use that block. So it was kind of like an experiment on my own, just like testing like my, like just testing the blocks to see how it works. I haven't actually, I don't know if I've shown you guys our place in a while, but I haven't been here in ages. I think the only times I come here in the past few, like few weeks is just to get food. But obviously we've got these villager guys, these are all gonna be moved um, eventually on our island. <laughs> but uh, obviously haven't had the time to do that. But the one thing I really wanted to see is what our house looked like in a shader, and I know it would look pretty nice. I think, like, just this angle here, the boat with the house, that would look pretty cool with the shader. Um, still need to finish this, though, redstone under here, which isn't too bad. We've still got 
Steve, I think, just stuck in that corner because he kept on like climbing and walking out. Uh, what else is this stuff? Like, we haven't really done much here, and that's kind of annoys me that I haven't done much here. Like, the hub has taken up a lot of the time on the fa on the fan server. Like, I really... That's all I'm doing at the moment. And that's going to change. Like, uh, we're going to slowly linger back into a few things, because after... We're at the point now where... I want to... I, I call them... You guys know I call them discs. Um, but they're not really discs anymore. We've kind of changed the shape just a tad. Um, Tylark tested a new shape uh, to fit more tunnels in because we had 22 tunnels per uh, per disc. Uh, so that would give us a total of 88. But what he designed something that allows it so we have 27. So then that gives us 108. So that gives us an extra 20 tunnels, which was just perfect. And just the shape alone bought me because just because of the fact that. Uh, that we can just fit more uh, more tunnels because I think that was an issue like I remember doing a post on reddit because um, someone had claimed a shop but they claimed it as a tunnel I think it um, I think their name was Schooner uh, it's not something I see on the server often and it's I, I have a guess he's just didn't obviously check reddit or our skype or whatever I probably should do something up here I just haven't decided um, but yes, like I came in one day and I already, he'd already literally built a tunnel, he dug a lot out and I was like, shit, I had to stop him before he does something, so why do I, oh, did I never take that dirt up there? Oh, where's my shovel? I'll go do that now. Um, still got my cat, I need to name him. I think I want to name him Jerry. <laughs> I don't know why, it just comes to my name when I, comes to my head when I think of that cat, I want to call him Jerry. But um, yeah, so uh, he started claiming a tunnel and everything, so I had to like stop him from claiming it. And um, I ended up making um, a Reddit post, just saying, you know, um, does no one claim any tunnels to until we're finished? Uh, we prefer that no one to claim tunnels or shop until it's done, just to keep it easy for us, so we don't have to maneuver around people, especially if some people start doing tunnels before we've even started designing stuff. Uh, that would be a bit frustrating. And um, what would end up happening is that, like I kind of like it's another system that like we kind of come up with is that no one's allowed to claim until after we finish kind of like a first come first serve this pig I kid you not I need to name him because he's always in this tunnel he's never left ever since I've built it but um like yeah like we've come up with this kind of first come first serve sort of thing and Dravan brought it to my attention uh, that he was like oh well it's not very fair especially if you finish it like 5 a.m. and it, it is kind of true that it's not very fair that it's first come first serve. I actually can finish this here. I got some slabs on me. I know they're for the hub, but I think I only need to put like seven or eight here. So let's do this. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Okay, that was more than I thought it was, but oh well. Oh, hello, chicken. There's chickens everywhere. I don't know why. I think someone's been going into the hubs and throwing a lot of chicken. So I have a guess there's something in my hub as well. Oh god, there's a lot of eggs there, so that makes me just think that... Are there any blocks that shine, like, through any blend in the desert? And and that shine and blend in the desert? Probably glowstone, is there anything I can think of that might blend? But besides that, I have no clue. But yes, like, we still need to finish this place. Like, uh, the reason why we haven't finished this place is glowstone. Uh, we got a lot of glowstone from donations from the nether hub, so if there's any spare, I'll probably take maybe half of that and donate it to this, <laughs> because I got a lot of glowstone to collect. I think I, I need to, like, four stacks or something. So we got that the hub, but I don't really want to take that. That's for the hub build. Um, what else is there? Like, we, we haven't really done anything else. Like, we've got our, you know, 1.7 snapshot terrain and then I want to make a 1.7 terrain because like this one's kind of cut off a bit it's a bit weird um, I don't really know how to do that one but yeah oh wait this one that's right this one takes me back to my island so that's mainly all the builds that we've done really we haven't done too many builds over the times so, um, I'm probably forgetting something or two uh, I didn't show the basement down here but like we go there all the time so you guys kind of know what that looks like uh, but I do want to get this island done. I, I really do mean that. I've said that a few times. That, like, it's not like I don't want to visit 
and like the, the island that house is our main base like everything that we're going to build is going to connect to that through that other nether hub so it's not like we're going to neglect it i just kind of want to get it finished so i can kind of look at some new projects because i've got some new ideas and some new stuff that i want to try uh but i just don't one, I don't have the time because I've, I've got so many projects going on. Like, another thing that I didn't show you guys, and, but you have guys seen plenty of, is uh, the nightclub. Like, that was another project that we worked on. Uh, it's not finished because I still need to finish the gentleman's club and the redstone in there. But besides that, that's, that's practically finished. Uh, so, like, the only last thing I have to show you is the, the nether hub because... Oh, that's right, I moved the entrance. I uh, moved it so it was more in a convenient location. I had to put uh, like this up and oh, people have been putting stuff in the chest again uh, but I'll read, I'll read this so I was like hello to all members me and Tyler are building the new nether hub or the new hub for everyone to use but it is not ready for people to claim tunnels or shops I put that in capitals to kind of make it stand down not like as if it's shouting it's just so people realize um, so please come down and have a look but don't go and start claiming areas or it'll be this or it will be destroyed um, <clears throat> the idea is not to allow anyone to claim shops or tunnels until the last block is placed. There will be a Skype and Reddit post to let you all know when the hub is complete. Kind regards, the Merry Gamer. So that's that's practically what the other post was on Reddit, and I had a link on that Skype. And like Javan was like, well, you know, if it's opens at 5 a.m., you finish at 5 a.m. at your time. It's going to be unfair for everyone else that's like on the other side of the world and that is true like either way there's always unfairness when, for what you do because you know like if i opened it at their time well it means it's going to like if i opened it at a convenient time for europe it means it's going to be either really really early in the morning for me so it doesn't like work <laughs> it like it's always someone that has to draw a short straw but the difference is is that there's going to be 108 tunnels we don't i don't even think so we can't have 50 up there so, yeah. So there's no doubt in my mind that there's going to be plenty of tunnels. And it's not like everyone's going to go into one section. Uh, I will advise everyone to look at their cords and go to the correct um, area. So um, it doesn't create confusion and like a nuisance for others. Well, that's lame. Light shines through regular ice, but not packed ice. <laughs> I didn't know that. That sucks. Um, yeah, so I ended up placing like these signs here saying, Welcome to the shopping district. Oh, the shopping disc. Please don't build tunnels under construction. Please don't claim any shops until finished. Uh, I think this was Tylux saying something. All shops will be at least 40 blocks of space besides the walls that uh, you can customize. So you can customize the walls here, I believe. Yeah, so you can't change this, but you can change this, like, this part of the wall. And you can go back 40 blocks. That's... That's as big as the shops can be, like, so they're more, like, long, uh, long tunnels. Uh, but it's not too bad, they're still pretty cool. Someone went down and placed some flowers here, though. And I don't think so, I, I don't know if I've showed any of that. I'm pretty sure I did show all this off. Um, no, I don't think so, I have, because a few things have changed. Like, that's I think we were looking at the walls last time. I ended up coming up with this design idea. Uh, it was actually Tylak's idea. He, uh, when, when we were doing it, I wondered why there was, uh, two redstone lamps like on the floor like on one of the like on like I think it was like that one over there and uh, I showed him like what I'd done I like done several little um, design ones and he said how about glass and I, I'm a bit like I like I really like using the glass but I'm a bit iffy with glass in nether because you have to figure out a nice block to go behind it and he placed the black glass and then he did these slabs and it worked I didn't mind it uh, it's a bit different we haven't really done anything else in the hub like that so it kind of made it unique and stand out so I really liked that this is just um, for Skuno who uh, started building a tunnel there like he ended up going really far um, I had to run his whole tunnel to find that he hadn't finished and run back and put the signs but anyway like uh, these are the uh, I might as well show you this one because this one's this one's the one that's getting done first so we've done all these connections here so these little tunnel bits this is how they ended up designing and looking like so I showed that off last time that Tylark started designing something that was didn't look so bare and this is what he came up with and I really liked it and we both went on with it and now at the point now where we're designing now I want to say discs but they're not but I'll give you an idea what it looks like so it's kind of like a disc so what it is is just imagine 
a um, these chickens, man. There are chickens everywhere. Like someone's just running around throwing chickens, and it's like okay, throwing chickens, haha, -ha, funny <laughs> sort of thing. They're annoying though. I'm the one that we are the ones that had to deal with the clucking. <laughs> but um, yeah. So to give you an idea, like the shape, it like we had originally a 55 block radius circle, uh, and then that ended up just quickly changing into like you just took out the corners to make it square and then all that ends up happening is that this little bit here that kind of bulges out kind of just as a like a few blocks further than the actual wall of the original circle so to give you an idea of the shape it's literally like an elongated um, <clears throat> square which you would say is a rectangle um, but it's only just slightly. I wouldn't exactly call it a rectangle, although it probably almost could be. It's just imagine a perfect square that you just grab the top and bottom and stretch it only by a very tiny bit. And then you almost as if you grab tweezers and pinch the two corners and pulled that out by like a few, like about like four or five blocks. And then doing the same by like two blocks at the top. And then that's how he practically, how he like the design looks in my description. But uh, it looks pretty good. It has 27 tunnels. So it's a total of 108, I believe. Yeah, uh, 27. Not 20. Yeah, wait, is it 108? Because uh, 22, 425 is 100. Then you got uh, 2468. Yeah, 108. So these are actually how the finished model designs are going to look, to give you an idea. So, oh wow, he's been. I didn't realize he'd started that though. Uh, let me. He's obviously started clearing out up here. I was wondering where all the the netherrack has come from. Ah, okay, he's been digging. Okay, so he started to dig here. All right, well, this is how the finished tunnels are going to look. Again, it kind of uses the stone look, but the stone works well with the acacia wood. And uh, this is probably what I'm going to get going and working with. Um, I might dig out all this area, maybe. I don't know. Uh, I do know, I don't, we haven't designed it fully, as Hylax said, he wants me to kind of finish like the design of how the top looks, so that's okay, because I kind of enjoyed designing how this one looked, because like, like when we designed this, like Tyler kind of came up with the, the, kind of like the pattern, and we kind of decided on blocks, and then he wasn't sure of the walls, and I just went crazy with the walls, and came up with this, so we might do the same sort of thing in there, but with just different colours, but uh, I want to test a few different patterns. But uh, that's probably going to be it for this episode. I know it's not a massive, um, you know, 50 episodes. It's, like, it's only 50. It's not like an 100 episode. Um, and it is unfortunate that we couldn't get any of the shaders working. Uh, I will look into that. I'm, I'm definitely testing. Uh, like, uh, I've, I've tested several times. Uh, that's why this episode's a bit late. Um, oh, it probably won't be late, actually. What time is it? Yeah, it will be. It's like 11.30, and normally my episodes come out on 12.30 on Fridays. So, uh, yeah, this one's probably going to be a bit later than normal. It's because I'm actually recording it on a Friday, not like the Thursday. But hell, that's all right. Um, it's quite fun building this. This takes up a lot of time, so that's probably a bit why I haven't done it. And this is all the shader stuff. But anyway, guys, that is going to be it for this episode. I know it's been a very talky one and probably a bit of a bore for some of you. But I know some people, some of you out there enjoy these ones. And uh, next episode, you'll probably see some more progress on the Nether Hub, and I might even possibly get some more time to do some stuff on some of our personal builds as well. But anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. So I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will see you all next time. Catch you later, guys.